Okay, this is me taking the trying to take the air cleaner off. Well, this is the air filter of my uh, SC50. I'm going to try to do some work on it without becoming angry. I'll just zoom out here. Okay, one second. <clears throat> yes, my SC50, which uh, I have put 97 kilometers on and uh, the gas tank is just starting to show a bit of gas being used so it's really quite works beautifully you know it's great on gas um, it isn't starting and I'm sure it's the spark plug is fouling because the uh, fellow who sold it to me One of the things he gave me was a brand new spark plug. So I'm pretty sure that, uh, you know, that's the problem. Anyways, I will document my, you know, my uh, working on this beastie and uh, we'll see what happens. So I have the air filter off. The air filter has been cleaned. I will actually, excuse me. Wow. Uh, the air filter. Well, I'll go and show you the air filter. One moment. Just hang on. Well, um, here is the air filter. Then I'll change that spark plug. And, um, well, we'll get this beastie running again. So I can go back to terrorizing the streets at 53 kilometers an hour. Anyways, uh, I'll be back. Oh, yes. I bought a Ryobi uh, electric screwdriver. And it doesn't sound very powerful, but it really does do well, even with screws that are, like, really in there. So, uh, my fun little toy. Anyways, uh, I'll be back with more of my repair. completed okay let's try to take off the seat access panel and see what we have I'll just uh, end this segment with a sweet shot of my beautiful SC50 and believe me it's pretty cool it takes a long time to get up to speed. It's slow. It only goes 53 kilometers an hour, about 30 miles an hour. Well, 30, 31. Uh, but I kind of like it, you know? Anyways, uh, I'll be back hopefully shortly.
well, to you guys, it'll look instantaneous, but, you know, that's the magic of video. <laughs> well, I found my pliers. Let's see if this will work. Sounds like it's working. Now, since this screw is basically, you know, stripped and has been taken out and put in quite a lot, I'm assuming that uh, this is, first of all, how you get to the spark, how you get to the spark plug, and that the spark plug issue is probably ongoing. Oh no. I think I tightened it. Well. Crap. Sorry. Righty tighty, lefty loosey. Okay. See if it'll lefty loosey for me. There. All right. Uh. Okay, we have the carburetor, and we have the down here, I believe, we have the spark plug. So I guess I have to take the side off, which means pulling out the seat. I guess pulling out the seat and pulling off this side. Okay. I have found the size of socket. It's the next to the smallest. The next size to the smallest. I don't know if that's the technical term, but that's the one that fits. Or, I could just phone technical support and ask them, whoa, my camera seems to be falling. <laughs> Wait, Mr. Camera, don't fall. Whoops, <laughs> we're ready now. Or, I could just phone technical support and ask them, uh, what body parts I take off to get to the car the uh, spark plug and in which order <laughs> something maybe I should have done the first you know b before I started this but you know you live and learn right <laughs> anyways see everybody later hope you're enjoying the actually maybe I'll make this the part one and I'll continue anyways um enjoy and I'll see you in my next video when I have a bit better idea of what the heck I'm doing now I will sorry I will leave you with uh, one more parting shot of my uh, quite possibly ill-fated SC50 the way I look at it like the way I see it I don't know what the heck I'm doing so I'm just going to say I'm going to have fun, I'm going to learn, and if I never learn how to fix it, at least I'll learn some stuff. But I'm sure I can learn. Anyways, bye-bye.